Hello everyone, welcome to science class today. Take a good look at the picture. Can you describe this picture? What's wrong with the boy? Hmm, he looks hungry and so sad because his plate is empty. Now take a good look at this picture. What can you say about this picture? She looks happy. She's having a cup of milk and she's smiling. Okay, now this takes us to something. Can you guess what our topic for today is? Did I hear you say something? Okay, let's see. Our topic for today is food. Can we all say that together? Food very interesting topic now you may want to ask me what is food yes food is what we eat to make us grow and look healthy like the boy in the picture hmm. now you ask another question where do we get food from we get our food from plants and animals. Plants like rice, beans, plantain, maize. Animals like goats and cows supply us with meat. Is food really important? Yes. Why is food very important to the body? We are going to find out why very soon importance of food importance of food number one food gives us energy it makes us strong food makes us grow well food makes the body healthy food helps to protect the body from diseases and food keeps us alive so we can live many happy years together how are foods preserved but how do we prevent our food from getting spoiled so we want to learn about how to preserve our foods now some foods can be kept in the fridge or a freezer some foods are fried some foods can be cooked well, some foods are kept in a can. Now, let's find out examples of these foods and how they are preserved. Yes, examples of foods kept in the fridge or freezer are fruits and vegetables. You have fruits like bananas, apples, tomatoes and you have your cabbages and all sorts of vegetables kept in the fridge your beef is kept in a freezer and your fish is also kept in a freezer to keep it fresh secondly let's check some examples of food that can be cooked yes we have a corn we have granuts, we have beans, and we also have rice. These are all tasty foods, and I know that you must have eaten some of these at one time or the other. Next, we want to see examples of foods that are fried. Foods that can be fried. You have your chicken as your fried chicken. You have your potato as potato chips. We have plantain as plantain chips. And you all agree they are quite yummy delicacies. Some examples of foods that can be canned are corn. Yes, you can preserve our corn in a can. Our drinks. All sorts of drinks are also preserved in cans. There are milk too. We have milk in cans. Now, I know you've learned a lot today. The foods help us to grow well and keep us healthy. 
Oh, I'll see you next time. Bye.